the common mallow. This is a part of a much larger family, which includes cotton, okra, and hibiscus. Common mallow is an edible plant that's been used for medicinal purposes throughout history, as well as edible. And this is a really nice patch of it right here, especially considering it's in with the alfalfa. There's some lamb's quarters hidden throughout here. Now, some people will call this common mallow. And let me see if I can focus in here. It's kind of hard right now. But the fruits are round and they have cheese-like wedges. Hence the reason why some people call it cheese weed. As you can tell, it likes to lounge close to the ground. And this has been used throughout history as an anti-inflammatory, a diuretic, an emollient, a laxative, and even an expectorant. All parts of this plant are edible. There's a nice flower. They can be added to a salad. The fruits can actually be substituted for capers. And when cooked, the leaves create a mucus that's very similar to okra, a very sticky substance. This plant can be dried to make a tea. And some people have used a thick liquid of this to use as an alternative to egg whites when making a meringue-like substance. I don't know how well that works. I've not tried it myself. Now these leaves are rich with vitamins A and C as well as calcium, magnesium, potassium, iron, and even selenium. This plant likes to grow in gardens, roadsides, waste areas, which is where I am right now. This is definitely a waste area, which is actually one of my grocery stores, you could say. And although this plant originates in Europe, Asia, and Northern Africa, this can be found all over the Americas and in Australia. The common mallow. Integrate this into your daily diet. Thank you for watching. And I have a link below for more information.